The Chargers are back on the road again and desperate to get a win before it's too late. They get a Bears squad who's facing a similar dilemma after dropping back to the 500 mark. Predictions are up in a sec, but first, a few key stats to ponder. Chicago has to hope that what they saw from Mitch Trubisky in garbage time last week will carry over into Week 8. And connects with Allen Robinson for a touchdown. Trubisky threw two TDs in his return from injury, but both came when the game was already pretty much over. Still, it was the first signs of life from an offense that has been pretty rough most games. Chicago's passing attack would seemingly be the best option to move the ball against LA, as they just gave up over 300 passing yards and a 120.1 passer rating to Ryan Tannehill. Tannehill, darts it, back of the end zone, touchdown! They are also ranked near the bottom in completion percentage allowed, rating allowed, and yards per attempt. And don't be fooled by their passing yards per game allowed, which would give the impression they are hard to throw against. They just haven't been thrown at a lot. But when teams have, they've been successful. The Chargers, too, should pretty much rely on their passing attack to generate yards. He'll flip it to the wide open Gordon for the touchdown. Phillip Rivers went for over 300 passing yards last week, and his top receiver, Austin Eckler. Caught by Austin Eckler for the touchdown. Eckler on the year is tied with DeAndre Hopkins for third most receptions in the entire league, and he could be in line for another good game because for all their defensive strengths, the Bears have struggled against backs as receivers, giving up the fifth most yards to them this year. Their D has also allowed one of the highest completion percentages in the NFL, meaning teams have found plenty of success by throwing short against them. Could a little dink and dunk lead the Chargers to victory? It's desperation time for both these clubs. Let's see how our panel of experts thinks it plays out. Rivers to the end zone, that's caught for the touchdown. Hunter Henry. You end up with Cam Kelly, their third safety against the guy who really is your favorite target.